Welcome to Veterans Medals Workshop, sponsored by Medals of America and by Medals of America Press. I'm Frank Foster, your host, and today we're going to talk about the Medals of the Republic of Vietnam and her allies. Everything you see today, plus all of the military and civilian medals of the Republic of Vietnam, is in my latest book, Medals and Insignia of the Republic of Vietnam and Her Allies, 1950 to 1975, available for you on Amazon. In 1949, Vietnam was made an associated state of the French Colonial Union. However, the French decided to withdraw after the fall of Dien Bien Phu in 1954, and a Geneva Agreement brought a ceasefire to Vietnam, but it divided Vietnam. And there was a huge exodus of refugees from the north to the south of Vietnam. And in 1955, the Republic of Vietnam was proclaimed. As a display of its new sovereignty, the state of Vietnam in 1950 issued medals of its own to go along with the new flag and the National Army. As the war progressed, there was still the occasional formal parade, such as the major one in Saigon on Armed Forces Day. Here you can see the President of the Republic in a white formal uniform with his left breast covered with four rows of medals. Around his neck and on his chest are two levels of the National Order of Vietnam, and we'll take a look at all five. If you look at this example of Vietnamese military ribbons mounted in the correct order of precedence, you can look to the upper left and see that the National Order is the highest and most prestigious of all South Vietnamese military awards. The National Order of the Republic of Vietnam was established in the summer of 1950 when the state of Vietnam became a part of the French Union. The award was patterned after Napoleon's Legion of Honor of 1812, and there'll be a picture of that in just a moment, and the French Colonial Order of the Dragon of Anam, which you're looking at now. The Dragon of Anam belonged to the independent monarch under the French control. So the Vietnamese National Order reflected the French influence by having five classes with similar insignia and service ribbons with rosette and silver and gold wings. And it's, well, it's the same manner of the French. The ribbon of the National Order is copied from the ribbon of the Order of the Dragon of Anam, and the green dragon is still present on the suspension of the medallion. Shown here on your left is the Grand Cross First Class of the National Order of Vietnam. That was established in the summer of 1950 when the state of Vietnam became a part of the French Union. The award was patterned after Napoleon's Legion of Honor of 1812 as an example to the right and the French Colonial Order of the Dragon of Anam. Uh, that's on the far right. The Dragon of Anam belonged to the independent monarch underneath the French control. The Grand Cross of the Order of the National Order First Class was composed of both a star and a planchet hung from a 100 millimeter sash ribbon worn across the shoulder. The National Order was the highest award for both distinguished service and bravery that could be given in Vietnam, and it was awarded for both military and civilian service. Let's take a little closer look at the planchet that hangs from the sash. The cross of the National Order is five patterned rays in gold, having at its center a red disc on which is engraved with gold letters the inscription, The Gratitude of the Fatherland. The, the distance between the lower arms of the star below the center disc is adorned with coiled dragon tails and green enamel. The suspension of the star consists of a dragon's head with a face of yellow gold with a green crest on either side. The back of the cross is shown on the left, and it is very plain. National Order Second Class, or called Grand Officer, was the award of the star, as shown here. Oh, one more thing. <laughs> if you enjoy these programs, please give us a like, or even better, subscribe. I mean, really, it's a lot better for us if you subscribe, because that'll keep us on the air. <laughs> okay, let's get back to the program. The National Order Third Class, or Commander, is shown on the left, and it was a neck badge with a larger medallion. Officer, or National Order Fourth Class, was shown as well in the center with a rosette, and then to the right of that was what was called Knight, or Fifth Class, and that was without a rosette. The far right is a very special version that was awarded to veterans. 
Here are four variations of the National Order of Vietnam. On your left, one made in the United States. Then the next one to the right was made in France. Another one made in the United States. And the final medallion on the far right was made in Vietnam. And you can tell the Vietnamese, Vietnamese manufacturer because the centerpiece is glued on and not stamped. The Medals and Insignia of the Republic of Vietnam is the only book in the world that I know of that covers all of the military medals and civilian medals of the Republic of Vietnam for its 20 years. It's available for you on Amazon, and if you order today, you can probably have it by this weekend. Oh, one thing I need to ask a favor, if you enjoy these programs, please subscribe and like us too, yeah. And that'll keep us on the air. Thank you.